My name is Philip Grete. I'm now first or about approaching second year postdoc at Michigan State University. The interesting thing about plasmas is that you practically find that everywhere in the universe. And I'm interested in the description where we can think about the plasma as a fluid. I'm mostly working with magnetohydrodynamics and magnetohydrodynamics describes the fluid that you have is threaded by magnetic fields. Everyone knows what turbulence is because uh, everyone, mostly all the people, have already been on a plane and uh, one of the major aspects is that you have seemingly chaotic motion. That analogy also translates to, uh, to plasma turbulence or magnetohydrodynamic turbulence where you have the same features but magnetic fields are also involved. It is very similar and the equations are comparatively simple. However, the effects that may occur are very different. So for example, if we think about uh, plasma turbulence, you need to imagine that the magnetic fields are frozen into the fluid. So if you have chaotic motion, then this automatically will introduce a very chaotic magnetic field. This tangled chaotic motion is able to amplify the magnetic fields. So this is called the uh, dynamo effect. And if you now think of a dynamo being transferring kinetic energy into magnetic energy, the question is how does that actually occur? And therefore I hope that with my, uh, with my research we will able to, to get a deeper understanding of what is the, the underlying processes and then at least being able to make statistical descriptions of, um, of what we can learn from those equations. I can only encourage people to think about pursuing not only plasma physics but also computational aspects. It goes in so many directions. That includes jobs in industry, jobs in, in research on Earth. For example, if you want to be part building uh, or solving our energy problem on Earth by support building a fusion reactor. But it also goes towards the fundamental questions on how the universe works and all that is governed under the umbrella of plasma physics. I would recommend to all students thinking about choosing a topic that they at least should consider plasma science in general.